There's not that many people. Kids splashing around kept space between one another unless they were part of the same family. Once in the pool, masks are not required. In fact, they're not allowed due to drowning risk. And the same goes for lifeguards up in the chairs. My home away from home, I'm so grateful that it's here. Residents feeling the heat expressed relief that the Pavonia pool was open today and will be open through the holiday weekend. I was like dreading that it wouldn't but I'm so happy that it has. But people must come in in shifts. Every two hours, the pool will shut down so lifeguards can perform an extensive cleaning. And since the pool is only open at 50% capacity, it'll give more residents their turn to access the pool. <laughs> residents entering are required to sanitize their hands before signing in. The city is tracking who was here and when for the purpose of contact tracing. Warning signs are also plastered all over the place, reminding residents to social distance and wash their hands. So I think everybody's going to be a little more cautious. City playgrounds as well as spray grounds and water features are also open here in Jersey City and the city is cleaning those regularly as well. The city's other municipal pool, Johnson Lafayette Pool, will reopen next weekend on July 10th. In Jersey City, I'm Christy Duffy, PIX11 News.